Hello everyone, welcome back. As you can see by the name of the video, I'm going to be running down the top five complaints about this game and uh, pretty much disprove them all. I was doing this previously on Son of Sparta, and for some of them I actually couldn't do, because, uh, yeah, I'll just get started now and explain later on. The camera spotted you. Alright, the first one on the list is spamming the same attack will raise your style rate. Uh, yeah, <coughs> excuse me. Uh, spamming the same attack will raise your style rating. Which I could not do on Son of Sparta because most of the enemies actually require you to switch up your attacks in order to, uh, in order to attack them, so it wasn't working there. So I'm gonna go ahead and get into it now and just show you that it does not happen. Okay, I'm going to keep spamming the same exact rebellion combo. As you can see, the style rating started going up. But now every time I spam it, the um, if you can look closely at the D, you can see that it's not even rising anymore. As you can see, I'm clearly spamming the same attack over and over again. I'm still having a D ranking right now. Kill this little cherub guy, still having a D rank. I don't know about you, but I don't see that style rating going up. Big shocker here, uh, people on the internet got it wrong, so. Alright, I'm just gonna kill all these guys just to, uh, just to really get the point home. So as you saw there, the, uh, style rating didn't rise at all. Still at a D ranking right there. Now I'm going to restart from a checkpoint and show you what happens when you mix up attacks. And that does not work because I killed them all. So I'm going to restart, uh, the whole level. All right, so that's one down, uh, four to go. And this one I'll actually be able to get, uh, to get two of the items down. Actually, no, just one of them. In the full game, you'll be able to get the other item, uh, down. Now, let's skip through these cutscenes like I usually do. Now, you saw in that last part of the video, as I was spamming the same attack over and over, the style rating didn't increase at all. I went through the entire wave of enemies, and the style ranking didn't go up. Now watch as I switch up attacks. This is the second part of the video that um, the gameplay is slow. Now that one is obviously one that could be uh, <laughs> blocking my vision there. That one's obviously one that can still be put up for opinion because the definition of slow changes between each person. But I think you can pretty much... Anyone calling this slow, I don't know how you could do that. I am playing on Nephilim, so they don't put up as much of a fight as they normally would. But this is the, uh, the second portion that's, supposed, that's doing with the uh, speed of the gameplay. And I'm pretty much proving now that it does, in fact, uh, move quickly. Alright, so I pretty much uh, tore through that wave of enemies there. All right, two down, and I have three left to go. The next one in line cannot be shown uh, completely in the demo. You would have to go watch. Go to CapcomUnity.com and search for the uh, DMC uh, Dante Must Die gameplay. That one you'll be able to get a better showing of what I'm about to do right now. But basically, the third item here is that this game requires less skill than the other games. Again, that is another one that... Uh, will mostly be decided by opinion, but for the most part, you can prove that it does take skill to play. The, the demo doesn't include all of the difficulties, so you won't be able to... That's why I'm saying to go watch the video, because I won't be able to show you as much as you would be able to see in the video. And because I have limited weapons to work with here. What I can show with the skill is the amount of things that you had from previous DMCs that you still have in this one. Knock that guy's shield down. 
there's one obvious one right there. You have the jump canceling, which is a fan favorite from the previous games. And there's also other things that they added newly. That there is a move with the uh, with the angel whip. What you do is you have to time it correctly. Whenever you, you can't just mash the button. You have to time it correctly. Whenever you hear the sound that sounds like uh, swords clashing, it kind of sounds like uh, two metal objects hitting each other. When you hear that sound, I'll do it without talking so you can hear it. Whenever you hear that sound, you have to press X immediately if you're playing the Xbox version. And it'll do an uppercut. Like that right there. And that'll just let you get them higher into the air. The third... The third thing on the list is that, uh, what is it, the frame rate's choppy. There was a demon of aid there. As you can see, it's uh, pretty smooth. You don't really see anything choppy. I think that was the fourth thing on the list. I'm not sure if I said third or fourth, but that was the, uh, that was the fourth thing. There's also a lot more things you can do to cancel, like to cancel a uh, angel dash. You can just, see that's the full angel dash brought out. Or you can just let go of the buttons and he'll drop out of it. Or if you want to cancel out of it quicker, you can use an attack while you're dashing. Or you can do a uh, air evade, which is the quickest way to get out of it. You have to do it pretty quickly. Because if you do it, um, if you do it, if you do it a little slower, what will happen is you'll just do a evade in one direction. <laughs> one direction. If you'll do an evade in one direction instead of doing it standing still. So you have to do that and you have to immediately let go. And then, uh, see, it's kind of hard to do. But that air evade can be used to do multiple things. This isn't good. Alright, the, uh. Oh! Uh, when it goes to the spamming the button, you saw when I was spamming the Y button on multiple enemies, the style meter wasn't going anywhere. It's uh, funny actually, if you play DMC4, I actually uh, played it recently, and if you don't believe me, I'll probably put up some videos showing it, but you can actually spam the same attack, but hit multiple enemies, and if you're spamming the same attack on different enemies, it'll raise your style ranking. Alright, so I think I actually covered all of the points, I'm not really sure what's left. I. Uh, I showed that spamming one attack does not raise your style meter. Showed that the gameplay is obviously not slow. Uh, showed that the game doesn't. The game takes uh, pretty much the same amount of skill. Obviously, this is a demo, so you're not going to get the full experience. There's still enemy types missing, so you won't be able to uh, show that completely. And then what else? I covered. All right, full list. The uh, frame rate's fine. Gameplay's fast. Uh, requires. Uh, I'm not sure if it's the same amount. I won't say that it requires the same amount of skill as DMC3, because DMC3 is probably one of the hardest games I've ever played. Uh, let's see. Spamming the same attack does not work. And... Yeah, I think that's pretty much it. I think I covered all the points there. And for those complaining about Dante's appearance... Well, bam. There is Dante with a red jacket and white hair, so... That's a bonus six, uh... Six complaint that I just covered. So yeah, if you still don't like the game, that's fine, but just don't keep using the same complaints on the internet because they're really, they're just not true. If you don't like the game just because you simply do not like the game, that's fine. Just don't start making up things. Because that's, that's when it gets a little ridiculous. Alright, uh, I'm gonna finish this wave of enemies and then end the video here. demonstrating a little bit of the canceling abilities there. Alright, so uh, that's the end of the video. There are some things that I can't show you because there are there are at least seven, uh, seven more enemy types in the full game. There are eight confirmed weapons, uh, two angel weapons, two demon weapons, three firearms, and uh, yeah, I think that's it. Oh, and then rebellion, which is the only human weapon. And yeah, there are seven difficulties. There's, uh, the ones that aren't in this demo are Dante Must Die, Heaven or Hell, and then, uh, Hell and Hell mode, 
which are familiar to anyone who's played the other DMCs. All right, hope you enjoyed the video, and uh, if there are any if there are any responses to this video, I'll probably go back and go back and do whatever people said I did or did not do. All right, so uh, yeah, I'll see you in the next one.